Uh, who needs comic books when you have people like this walking the earth? Hey guys, I'm Rebecca from Watch Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 real human superpowers. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Yeah, that means we're looking at unusual human abilities that actual living humans have that go way beyond the norm. These are real superpowers, y'all. All right, let's see what they can do. Number 10, Super Tasters. They walk among us, hidden in plain sight, carrying a burden the average taster will never fully understand. Okay, the life of a super taster isn't that dramatic, but it does take eating and drinking to a whole nother level. As the label implies, super tasters experience taste with much greater intensity thanks to a few extra fungiform papillae, also known as the tiny taste bud covered bumps on our tongues. This real human superpower has been known to heighten the eater's response to bitter foods like cilantro, Brussels sprouts, and coffee. Some believe this unique evolutionary skill was developed to help humans avoid potentially toxic plants, but the truth remains a mystery. Number 9. Tetrachromacy Most humans only have three types of cone cells in their eyes, which means they only have three channels for receiving and interpreting color information. Those affected with tetrachromacy have four, meaning they can see light from an additional section of the light spectrum. While tetrachromacy is common in birds, fish, and insects, who use it for mating, hunting, and pollination, it is much rarer in humans. While tetrachromats can't see through walls or shoot lasers from their eyes, they can perceive a wider range of colors than the average human, and that's pretty cool in our books. Number 8. Short Sleepers The average person is asleep for one-third of their life. In fact, most people spend more time in bed than we do working, eating, and binge-watching Netflix combined. However, there are some who only need a few hours of sleep per night. These short sleepers can sometimes need as little as four hours to recharge. This translates to roughly 60 extra days per year. A 2009 study out of the University of California found that people who require less sleep have a mutation called DEC2. Some have nicknamed it the Thatcher gene after former Prime Minister of the United Kingdom Margaret Thatcher, who allegedly only slept for four hours every night. Number 7. Surviving Freezing Temperatures Imagine running a half marathon in minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit dressed in nothing but a pair of shorts. How about being submerged in ice for an hour and 44 minutes? Well, if you're Wim Hoof, also known as the Iceman, such seemingly impossible challenges are actually well within the realm of possibility. Hoff is an extreme athlete who has set multiple world records using his ability to withstand extreme cold. The Dutch daredevil claims that his superpowers are the result of a specific set of breathing techniques, which he calls the Wim Hof method. If this isn't a real-life human superpower, we don't know what is. Number 6. Echolocation Echolocation is extremely common in the animal kingdom and is most commonly associated with bats and dolphins. It works by creating a sound that then echoes off of the surrounding environment. When the sound bounces back to its source, it creates a map of the area much like a sonar device. Incredibly, this is a skill that human beings can learn. Ben Underwood was diagnosed with retinal cancer as a child and had to have his eyes removed. He taught himself echolocation and used frequent tongue clicks to map his surroundings, enabling him to play sports and even ride a bicycle. Superheroes should inspire, and Ben Underwood, a real-life daredevil, did just that. Number 5. Scaling Buildings We've covered Iceman and short sleepers, but now it's time to take things up a notch. Enter the human spider. French climber Alain Robert has been dazzling the world for years with his insane scaling abilities. He has free solo climbed everything from the Burj Khalifa to the Sydney Opera House. How does he pull off these awe-inspiring feats of vertical daring? With nothing more than a pair of climbing shoes and a bag of chalk. Robert finds small crevices and protrusions on the sides of buildings and structures and uses them to climb to the top, a process that can sometimes take hours and offers little in the way of rest time. Number 4. Withstanding Pain While some people take the mind-over-matter approach to withstanding pain, others have a genetic resistance to it. A small percentage of the population is affected by congenital insensitivity to pain with anhydrosis. Essentially, this means the person in question does not feel pain of any kind or any nerve-related sensations. The anhydrosis means you don't sweat, either. This could be something as little as a scratch on the arm to broken bones and burnt flesh. While this sounds like a recipe for an awesome comic book character, it's actually quite dangerous. Pain is there to tell us when something is unsafe. 
Without it, we could go for months with an injury or ailment without knowing, leading to chronic pain or even death. Number 3. Super Strength One of the most common fictional superhero qualities is super strength. It's been a fixture in everything from Greek mythology to modern film. But did you know that it actually occurs in real life? Take Tim Boyle. In 2006, he witnessed a car accident that left a man pinned beneath a Chevrolet Camaro. Boyle rushed over and lifted the car off the injured man, who was able to escape. Then there's Sakina Khanapiva, an aging Russian woman and Guinness World Record holder who was twisting steel rods and lifting 50-pound dumbbells well into her 70s. While Boyle's strength can be chalked up to adrenaline, it would appear that Khanapiva is just a straight-up beast. Number 2. Running Forever Dean Karnassus' Wikipedia page describes him as, quote, an ultra-marathon runner. And that pretty much says it all. Simply put, the man is a machine. In 2005, he ran 350 miles in 80 hours and 44 minutes without sleeping. In 2002, he went to the South Pole and ran a marathon in minus 13 degree Fahrenheit temperatures without snowshoes. However, his most publicized running accomplishment came in 2006 when he ran 50 marathons in 50 consecutive days in 50 different states. Carnassus is not the only ultramarathon runner, but he's definitely the most famous, and he hopes to one day run a marathon in every country within the span of a year. Talk about superhuman. Number 1. Super Intelligence Unlike their cartoon counterparts, humans with super intelligence do not have oversized craniums or evil layers. What they do have is the ability to perform complex calculations in their head at blisteringly fast speeds. The group most often associated with this skill are people with savant syndrome. They often have enhanced memory skills and are able to perform rapid calculations or other special skills. Other people have eidetic or photographic memories, which is the ability of a strong and precise memory recall even if you've just had a few moments of exposure to something or someone. Then there are those who can perform such feats as listing the first 100,000 decimal places of pi. In the case of Kim Peek, it's remembering every aspect of more than 12,000 different books. Clearly, you don't need a cape and mask to be a superhero. Dude, can you imagine running non-stop from Los Angeles to San Francisco? That running forever guy can do that. I get tired after 15 minutes on the treadmill. Yikes. Anyway, if you're not too tired right now, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out these other videos for your viewing pleasure. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.